the we I mean every municipality were who has the opportunity when we passed this bill is because certain municipality asked for that ability to do that. So we did that. And it's it's incumbent upon that municipality who wants to help their constituency and there are and I, I I'm not saying that Pepeca doesn't, Pepeca, you know, is my it's been my home for the last forty eight years. Yes, they you know, I don't know what their reasoning was for not soliciting, but every city in town has that ability. The bill was passed and the, the cities know they have that, that, that option to do it. I have a question. Um, so for the energy aggregation plan and the lack of its presence in Pawtucket or its implementation in Pawtucket, it's a matter of whom to educate the constituents. Whose responsibility is that? Well, it's it's certainly. I mean, it's all of our responsibility. It's the you know, it's it's a, it's a city of it's a city of Pawtucket. It's my responsibility. First and foremost, it's the city's responsibility to, to participate in it. If they chose to participate in it, then that you know that comes into you know to that gets passed on to their uh, to their you know to their residents. Okay. But if they don't pa if they choose not to go to the into the program. May, may I ask one more, please? Uh, so it's it's dependent upon the council, city council, to so the constituents who speak to the city council. City council, like in a town hall, would then bring it to you, and that's how we would get involved. How would that work? No. So because we can't make the city and town participate. We create the laws that they everybody can participate. So now it's up to the city council and the and, and the and the administration to decide whether or not to participate. May I ask a question? Are there incentives to encourage cities and towns to participate? Well, the, the, the encouragement is that their constituency would benefit from the savings. So we're going to have to pick up the pace if we want to get through this, but I just want everyone to know that the George Wiley Center did sign up to the aggregate, and partially in Massachusetts, other states have been way ahead of us, so mm -hmm. it's good that Finally, um, there is some movement in Rhode Island. 